What's going on, y'all? We're here at the Come Up Experience 2023, the Brooklyn Grammys. I have Brooklyn in the building. L. Smith, how you doing? Yo, I can't complain. I really can't complain to be in a building with all these people, man. Humbling experience. Yes, I love that. Well, you're nominated tonight for Male Come Up Artist of the Year. How does it feel to be nominated Yo, for it this feels award? good. It feels good. The crazy part about it is, you know, I'm in a lane with, with, with rappers. Right. And I'm an R&B singer, you know, so it... Mm -hmm. It's very humbling, man. Like, I appreciate you for interviewing me. Yes. I, well, I'm happy to be here. I'm happy to speak with you. Listen, to be an R&B artist definitely takes a level of vulnerability and transparency. I want to know what is the current season of your life that you're in right now? Well, I can say the current season that I'm in right now is, is in between. But also, my single, Why'd You Go, I Was Hurt. You know, and I wanted the people to feel where I came from, you know what I'm saying? Right. Like, because I believe that's what R&B been missing, yes. feeling, you yes. know what I'm saying? That's why people say R&B is dead. When it's really not dead, I always say it lived through me. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, hurt, pain, love, casualty, lies, deception, that all comes with love to me. Right. Yeah. Well, um, you're from Brooklyn. Talk a little bit about kind of growing up. What has your experiences have been that have kind of shaped the type of artist that you are? Well, I'm from I'm from Brooklyn, but I'm from the Nine East Flatbush, uh -huh. and um, you know, going through a lot. You know, I've had a lot of heartbreaking experiences. I've had a lot of loving experiences. I had a lot a lot of lies told to me. Mm -hmm. You know, and it molded me to be this because I watched my friends be this way. Right. And I always said I wanted to be the opposite. Right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, I seen my friends be dogs. I just wanted to be different. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? But Certified lover boy or? I ain't gonna lie. That's what they say to me. Like, y'all, they say I'm a hopeless romantic. Oh, I love that, though. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. We're not gonna do that to no, me right now. No, we're gonna do it because it's cuffing season. I want to know, what are some of your essentials for cuffing season? How can we make it to the matching pajama stage? Yo, it's so crazy. <laughs> Stop laughing. That's not funny. Oh, my God. With me, um, Dad, why we got to do this on the orange carpet? We can't do this behind the scenes. Um, with me, it's more like truth, honesty, you know, because, again, I'm not... I'm not hard. I'm not hard to follow. Like I'm, 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 I'm very soft spoken. You know, I make things happen when I need to happen. Right. You know, cause I believe nowadays that the rules have switched. Talk a little bit about that. I knew you was gonna do that. Talk a little bit about that. <laughs> I believe females are the new gods, and the gods accept it, and they just move with it. Mm -hmm. I'm an alpha male. I'm, a, I'm, I'm a real god. Uh huh. No. Babe, what you need? You okay? I feel like it's really the guys, though, that are in the sassy epidemic. No, no, I'm agreeing with you. What I'm saying to you is, y'all are the new males. And we are the I mean, new, we, well, I we can't say we. To, we have to be, you know. But what I'm going to say to you is this, though. The reason why y'all are the new males is because y'all haven't came into a person as such as myself. Mm -hmm. To where I'm going to tell you, like, yo, relax, my, I got you. Mm-hmm. Oh my God, no, shut up. I got it. Don't worry about it. I'm yeah. going to make everything okay. Mm -hmm. And that's what's missing today. And I've been through my shares and pains of, you know, being lied to and stuff like that. So I put my, my pain on paper and I'm here because of that. Right. Then, um, so. Tell the people what up and coming projects you have coming out and where they can follow you at. Oh, okay. I have a, a EP coming soon. Um, it's going to drop on my birthday, May 7th. Um, I'm Taurus? working on Yeah, I'm a Taurus. Okay. I'm dropping I'm dropping a lot this year, man. Okay. I think I believe 2024 is my year. Uh I just spoke to um I ain't gonna say a lie, I just spoke to one of the goats, my boy Deva. I just spoke to my dog, he over there with um with Spice Everything Nice. Shout out to them. I'm definitely gonna get a feature with him. And I'm going to make this, it's going to be, it's going to be a movie today. Yes. It's going to be a movie. Well, I'm looking forward to see everything that you have coming in yes, 2024. I appreciate and you. wishing you best of luck. Appreciate you. Male come up artist of the year. Yeah, that's crazy. Thank you. Yep, L. Smith. Yes, sir.